This is a, uh, an example of some of the problems Remoteless app has with Spotify, at least the US version. This is on a Macintosh running a 1.07 helper that I just downloaded. Um, as you can see, Spotify is running and it's running Coldplay. I have not run the app even yet, but I'm going to go ahead and start it now. And part of the problem is it must buffer the album that it played last and it stays there because you'll see when this launches it will have the wrong uh, album art. There it is. It has Foster the People's album artwork which I played earlier when I was testing it without recording. And now I'm playing Coldplay which clearly as you can see has the wrong album artwork and even if I launch the iPhone app it, it'll do the same thing so it's buffering the wrong album artwork initially as well. The other thing that I don't understand about this app is this slider bar down here. It doesn't do anything. For example, I'll slide this and it doesn't do anything. That music didn't get louder. Nothing's happening over here either. I'm sliding this. Here, I'll move it all the way down. I don't know what this is. Is this a volume control? Because if it is, it doesn't work. This doesn't do anything. I'm sliding it right now and it's not doing anything to Spotify itself. So I'm not even sure what that even is. Now the other thing that's uh, basically the app is, to me anyway, I'm inside a playlist called uh, US Rock 40 and I can move to the next song and I will hit it and it moved to the next album here which is called Sail. As you can see the album art changed and here we are still stuck in the same Foster the People album artwork. I'll even go back to uh, Coldplay. Well, let me hit it again. Back to Coldplay, and the album artwork is still there. So there's a bug in the album artwork buffer or whatever it is. Now the other thing I don't understand about this app is I'm inside a playlist. Here are my songs inside this particular playlist. So if I go hit browse, now as a user I expect to be able to go back to that playlist and it it has this master list now. Uh, it, it's not it doesn't know where I was, I guess, on the initial launch, unless maybe this launched it. So here I am in a playlist called Rock 40, but when I hit uh, browse here, I'm in the master list. So I have to go back and find the playlist that I'm in to get to more songs in that playlist. So I'll just hit it here just to do it. Uh, what is it, Rock 40? So I'll hit it. Now again, my options are, here are the songs in the playlist, but I'm going to go ahead and pick a song Let's, uh, let's pick uh, here uh, Rope, and I'll pick it, and look, it blanked out. There's, there's nothing here to pick after that. Uh, sometimes you'll get a play track or play album here, and sometimes it won't. It's just blank. There's no way for me to launch a new song in this playlist because there's nothing here anymore. Okay? The only way I can successfully do anything would be to go back, hit the back, and hit play all in the playlist and uh, no, nothing there either. So as you can see the, it still has bugs. I mean essentially the only thing I can do is I guess, I don't know, re try to relaunch it which I'll do. I'll, I'll relaunch it. I got, I'll, I'll go ahead and uh, kill the app and I'll relaunch it so it can maybe try to resync up. And um, it still has the wrong album artwork. You know, I can move fa forward and backward, but if I obviously if I hit the browse button, I get the playlists again, and I'll just pick something totally new this time. How about uh, top 40? And I'll hit play all in this playlist. And here's where it gets weird: the uh, Spotify moved to that playlist, but is not playing any song. It's still playing the old song that I had picked. Um. See, as you can see, I'm not sure what it thinks it's doing there. It's completely out of sync. I have no idea. It's playing a, a track from, I don't even know where it's getting it. It's not playing it with inside that one. So, see what happens here? It completely loses itself. And that's been the problem. And it, sometimes in the past, this is locked up, but you guys gave me a new helper. And this particular helper at least is doing album artwork and doesn't seem to be locking up the iPad 
the way it did before. But as you can see, it's it's just completely out of sync. And there's look, I'll hit forward here, and it it'll play some song, but not within the playlist that it moved to. So I assume it's somewhere. Um. I can't even find where it's at. Okay, I finally found it. It's... Wow. Okay, I found it here. Again, the album artwork, as you can see, is completely different. And if I go back and I say, well, it says I'm in the hits 40. And here's another thing. It, if I pick a song that is in this playlist... It's it yeah it's completely out of sync. Yeah, it's completely out of sync. I don't even know. Okay. But anyway, let's go to a whole new playlist then. Play a play a whole new playlist. Hit back. I'll do a trance classics to completely change it up. Hit play all in the playlist. It doesn't play. It didn't start it off. So it's not moving. It's it's not it's not in sync. But see, I hit trance and Spotify finally moved to that playlist, but it didn't start the first song. We're still here in La La Land. So this has been the problem. It's it's just out of sync. And the other problem I've always had too with this is if you pick a song in the, within its the playlist, let's say I pick Orange Theme or whatever this song is here. Now this one finally came with, I can play the track. As Like I said before, it, sometimes it plays or disappears, but it didn't launch the track. Well, finally it did. Okay, there it went. But here's the problem. Another problem. I launched one song in a playlist, and when you do that, Spotify might play it or play it, but what it does, it goes to this album as opposed to staying within my playlist. So if you want to jump around within your playlist like you would your iPod, Spotify jumps out into the uh, artist albums. So now you're completely out of sync with your uh, playlist. I'll go, I'll go back here and I'll back it up one time. And as you can see, here's the playlist. But yet, on Spotify, because I picked a song out of order in the playlist, I just randomly picked one, Spotify moved to the album of that artist only. So even if you were to advance to the next song, you're just going to get the next song. So if I come here and I say, fine, give me another song in the playlist, I should still be within the playlist on Spotify instead of the album's artwork. I mean, you know, the album of the, the artist. I'll play the track and Spotify moved over and it's playing it. Of course, I still have this stuck album artwork. But notice the artist, I only have, I only wanted to play one song on my playlist but yet it played it, but yet it stuck me with the same artist's albums only. So there's no way for me to forward in advance. So now if I go back to my playlist, there it's here, but I'm not within my playlist now. I, I, I would have to individually pick these songs. If So if you were to, let's say, want to play the third song, Spotify should play it. And then let's say with my list here, I sh should move on or just hit advance. I'm completely now out of the playlist because I picked one song to play. It shouldn't work like that because when you pick a song, it has play track, go to artist. So what's happening, I think, is even though I'm saying play track, it plays track but also goes to artist in, in Spotify when it should only play the track and stay within my playlist. So that's another problem that I've noticed uh, as well. Uh, hope this helps, guys.